I'm back. Yeah, next tutorial bits here. <laughs> what we're gonna be looking at now is this side of things. Behind, behind the screen, behind the scenes, the inner workings of what's making this stuff actually work, you know? Into the eyeballs and brain. Oh, oh my god, this is sick. Hello, guys. Yeah, so maybe this is the thing that I'm currently inside the head of the character because we will be looking at the more technical workings of working out a live stream. We've done most of the kind of cosmetic side of getting this stuff working. We've done a metahuman creation, head to toe, body suited with a new armor and stuff. We've done scene and asset creation, creating cool custom assets like this quirky keyboard where none of the keys line up well or anything. We have done lighting creation as well, getting beautiful god rays, camera effects, blah 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 blah. So what's next? I hear you ask. What very well is next is... Hey, what's next to do is get inside the head of the live streamer and figure out how to actually live stream. The final component in this beautiful avatar setup is live streaming. So yeah, as a bit of a rundown, lowdown, showdown, let's see what we got. We're gonna be doing streaming stuff. So the final goal of this is to have your own virtual broadcast studio. We're gonna go through everything to do with that. We're gonna do installing, uh, grabbing Spout, grabbing OBS, grabbing all your plugins that you need, getting the off-world live plugin, obviously. We're gonna look at streaming in alpha, so alphaing yourself out nicely on a background. Gonna go into OBS and why it's so good, some of the sick things you can do in that. We're gonna do NDI to connect multiple computers up. Gonna be doing Spout in from OBS and then editing that Spout in. We're gonna jazz up whatever screen we're making in Unreal. We're gonna do some uh, material edits to the live feed that's coming into Unreal to make look like a CRT monitor, stuff like that. So you can have your stuff streaming into Unreal in real time and you can add effects onto it in real time. Camera angle changes on a button push and other blueprints like that. And then uh, as we get into stuff that's more advanced, we're gonna dissect the off-world live camera a little bit and turn it into a pawn, which is using some of the Unreal Games logic to make that pawn your main playable character and then possess other things in your level as that character. We're gonna make a curved LED wall, we're gonna look at UV and stuff, and then we're gonna look at some optimizing stuff for, for both your camera and for Unreal in general, your FPS. So visual optimizing and also performance optimizing. Keep an eye out for links in the descriptions for free downloadable assets. We've now got a download center on the off -world Live website where we're gonna be chucking blueprints, assets, and whole project files for you to download for free and use as you wish. So check out the links in the descriptions for those. What a load of treats we have in store for you. Um, yeah, as I say, by the end of it, the end goal is to make an awesome broadcasting studio. And by the end of this series, you're gonna be a pro at streaming, super streamer professional. So without further ado, uh, please do follow along this next series of Bounty and I really hope it's useful for you and I'm just hyped on making it. I hope you guys can get hyped on it too and get really creative with some of these tips. So yeah, let's get on with it. Ah. <laughs>